Hi guys, welcome to another video and today we are going to be doing a quick quarter hunt. So as you can see, I just have six roll of quarters here and we're going to open them up, see if we can find some silver, any varieties, any errors we can find. And one coin that did catch my eye is this very nice bicentennial uncirculated ender. It's pretty cool. I think I might keep that and put it in my collection because it's a really nice looking one. Got lots of luster. Take a little close up of that right there. <clears throat> it's in nice condition. So, first thing I'm going to be doing before I open these is, um, well, when I open these is scan the edges, see if there's any silver. So I'll do a quick time lapse of that. And, uh, yeah, so let's get on to it. Alright guys, so I'm halfway through scanning the edges, I'm on my third roll, and this actually caught my eye right here. As you can see, there's no copper on that edge. It actually looks really good. So, let's see what's in here. Nope, this looks like a normal uh, quarter. It's normal South Carolina State quarter. Looks like someone painted the edge though. Or it's silver plated, one of the two. As you can see, there's definitely no copper. That's pretty weird. I know that happens to a lot to um, some coin channels, though. Like California Coins, he gets a lot of painted coins that have silver edges. I'll set that aside anyway over here. It's pretty interesting. So, let's keep on going. Alright, guys. So, I'm on the last roll of searching through. And this one definitely caught my eye. This one is much thicker than the last one that was um, painted. And it's also insanely shiny. So, let's check this out. Just a normal one, but it looks plated. It's kind of got a weird color to it. It's just a 1821 Missouri state quarter, but it's definitely weird looking. It might be silver plated. Because silver proofs are only made in um, San Francisco, and this is definitely not a proof. But it kind of does look like a silver colored, so it looks like it's plated. And this one just looks like it's like maybe painted because it doesn't have that same color. It's pretty interesting though. Looks like we do have two plated coins. Doesn't look like there's anything else, so. So what we'll do is look through these quarters, see if there's anything interesting in them. And I'll get back to you guys once I find something. Alright guys, so I went through those six rolls of quarters. <clears throat> and this is what we found. So it was actually a pretty interesting hunt for uh, uh, roll, uh, quarters. So as you can see, we found a bunch of bicentennials. And as some of you may know, I do like bicentennial quarters. I actually know a couple of people who don't even collect coins, but just collect bicentennial quarters but on their own. And these are the nicer ones that I'll be keeping. And also I pulled these two uncirculated um, quarters out. Sometimes just like pulling these out for fun. Might even keep them sometimes. And then we did have these two weird plated ones. And these um, could have been part of mint sets. They could have, someone just could be pranking me and coloring the edges of them to make me think they're silver. But sometimes companies do take the quarters and then plate them and then sell them for profit or something like that but uh, anyways who knows so hope you guys enjoyed this quick hunt and if you guys want to see more make sure to like and subscribe sorry about my voice still got that cold and sinus infection from um beginning of the week so hope you guys enjoyed this video 
And if you guys have any questions or comments, make sure to comment them down below, and I'll always respond. And I hope to see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.